hot dog. <laughs> Ma, quit vlogging me. I'm furious. <laughs> hot dog. Yay! <laughs> Good job. <laughs> Roly polies. She just had her feet crisscrossed up in the air. It was so cute. Yeah, hi. <laughs> She just waved and said hi to the camera. You are so cute. You can go bye bye. Bye bye. Bye. Bye bye. 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 Is daddy teething too? <laughs> oh, you might be getting your teeth ripped out. So Chelsea's getting in like four teeth. Her gums are all red. So she has a cold teething ring. Oh, dada. Oh. <laughs> Where is it? Oh. Oh, it was on your head. Uh, oh. Oh. Run! Run! Here it comes, here it comes! Oh no. She knows how to do it. I love you. I love you. Aww. <laughs> Even though it's so annoying, it's so cute. Yeah, is it working? I'm okay. How's this ticker sound? <laughs> is he gonna make it? Turns her head to listen. Yeah, she turns her head. Is it working? music on the TV. <laughs> my little pony, my little pony. Your turn. You out now? This won't hurt a thing. No. <laughs> no. Does it work? Jeez, oh, those hurt. I know it does. I know. I've tried it before. <gasps> yep, sounds all good. Oh, we're even doing the spinning now. just fell out. Cute. Ooh. Yeah, we've just been busy. 
Okay, so it's put in video. I always do. Dear my colleague Alex, Chelsea, and Ed, my name is Andrea and I live all the way in Canada. I'm 16 years old and I love your videos. I watch them every single day and they are very entertaining. I'm not sure if this letter will get to you, but if it does, then hi. It did. We got here. I also sent you a loony and a toony from Canada. Cool. I was in America this year and I saw my first MLP, MLP blind bag of the glitter ones. I love my pony, but I have only seen them in America. Oh, I didn't know that. I haven't seen any vinyl figures, mashems, MLP, or even squinkies in Canada yet. So I was wondering that if you had any extras, doubles, or any you don't want, if you could send some back. If you don't, that's fine, but I only have one MLP lucky something, and I would want that or some other toys. I remember the first video I watched, which was Creepy Sleepwalker two years ago. Wow. When she, when she was Alex tends to sleepwalk. <laughs> well, time. not anymore so much, right? Yeah, it's, no, it's been, been a long a while. time. It's been a while. I think Your since kids... we went to Michigan last. Maybe. No, it was it was before that. Your kids are so cute, and Chelsea's eyes are so big and adorable. Thank you. I would also like for you to sign your names on a piece of paper like your other fans did. Also, I'm a runner, and I run my first half marathon on August 24th. Yay! Go Thank you! you. Good job. I'm really nervous. Oh, you'll do great. Actually, it's in the, you already did it. <laughs> Actually, you did great. You did great. Good for you. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> I'm wondering if your family has ever considered to run from Andrea. P.S. There's a sticker in there of Fluttershy, which I got. Um, the only way we would run is if zombies were chasing well, us. Yeah. <laughs> I can't run. For one, I kind of, I have problems breathing, Lungs. especially in the heat like this. Like my physical body could do it, but I could not do it for an extended amount of time. I could not even do it when I was a younger person. So there's, I don't have, I'm fast. In short lengths. <laughs> I cannot do the long distance stuff. Okay, and I used to, or like in the winter time for Florida winter, um, I like to go out and fast paced walk kind of jog. Like I can't like run for long distances. Again, like Michael said with the heat and everything. But when it gets nice out, I will go and I'll like kind of like jog and stuff like that. And I enjoy it. And that's when I tend to get in shape is like when it's cool outside because I can actually stand to be out there. <laughs> Dad's getting old too. But <laughs> I would love to be able to run and like do marathons and stuff like that, but or half marathons, but I just don't know. Um, I'll throw on some ice skates and skate it. Yeah. That I could do. <laughs> that you can do. And that's fun. And she did a couple of drawings, a Fluttershy and what was the other one? A kitty? Yep. I can't tell because I'm yep. looking from behind. And then she did these cool drawings on the top. Oops. <laughs> Across the top. So thank you so much, Andrea. That is so sweet. And I'll have to find a special place to put Fluttershy. And oh. Is there something else supposed to be in there? Or is it just that's the sticker? That's signatures. I thought she said she was going to put loonies in there. Loonies and toonies. What are those? Coins? There's nothing yeah. in here. Uh-oh. There is a... <gasps> There's a tear. There's a hole. Oh. Thanks a lot, UPS. Right there. No, that's Postal Service. That's the Postal Service. Oh, right they there. got lost. No loonies and toonies. What are loonies and toonies? Coins? Yes. I've got some. We've got some from last time we went to Canada. Oh, that's right. We do. Yep. Oh, thanks for the thought. At least Flutter, Fluttershy made, made it. it yeah. <laughs> well, thank you. One more mail. Hey, my colleague Alex and Chelsea, I'm going to start off by saying I love you guys so much. I watch your videos every day. I'm 15 years old and a sophomore in high school. You guys have inspired me to do so many new things. That's awesome. I love logging into my YouTube and the first thing I do is watch the daily vlog. I love how you guys keep us updated about everything. Holly, I am praying for you. Thank you. You guys are so strong and amazing to keep the videos going even through tough times. You have all you always have a positive outlook. I also love seeing Alex and Chelsea grow. Oh, I forgot to mention my name is Julia. I am also a competitive gymnast on team. Wow, that's awesome. I also dance. Does Alex do any sports or has she ever done any? She did soccer for a year. For a two. little while. She well, that, did yeah, gymnastics. Did we do it what we did it two, two years. years? Soccer was two years. She did gymnastics for a while. You guys saw that last year she did gymnastics. 
Um, but other than that, just like riding her bike and walking the dog and stuff like that. Also, what made you guys decide to do homeschooling? Um, well, you were. I always kind of wanted to homeschool. You were. So. You did homeschool yourself. I, d I did homeschool for a little while in high school, and I always wanted to... What? <laughs> I don't know. What Our battery's doing. flashing. I have to change the battery. Oh. <laughs> so we'll be back in a second. And action. <laughs> okay. So what, what made us decide to homeschool? Um, Alex is in public school through second grade, and in third grade, they start what's called the FCAT, which is um, standardized testing. And there are a lot of things going on in the school. Like I volunteered at the school a lot, so I saw a lot of the things that were going on every day, and I just didn't like them. And our school system is just kind of like going downhill. And I always wanted to homeschool her. Yeah, I mean that's almost and moot point because we were going to homeschool yeah. no matter what. We planned that. We so. always wanted to, and it was just a matter of waiting for the right time to homeschool. And we just decided to go for it, and it's been great. So we're going to keep doing it. Um, I was also homeschooled, but for middle school, that's cool. You guys used my question of the day. The video was posted on 6 12 14. My last name is pronounced Farguson, although it's actually spelled Fargarrison. It was the best feeling seeing my name in your video. Does Alex still have her ears pierced? Yep. yep. Yes, she does. Will Chelsea get hers? When she's old enough to decide. Yeah, she when she's because she made the decision to we, get them done. Yeah, we believe in like letting them make a decision about putting a hole in their body. <laughs> We're not gonna do it when they're <laughs> little. Putting like, a hole in their body. Like I would never pierce the baby's ears if somebody out there does that, and that's totally your decision. But that's just how we felt about it. Um, I love you guys. Please write back, Julia. My Instagram is gymnast love Julia. It would mean so much if you would follow me. We will do that. So thank you so much. And she sent some drawings. Some for Eddie. Really pretty. Ooh, Mike. Nice. Look at those colors. Beautiful. Ooh, Holly. You got the rainbow, rainbow colors. <laughs> I love the rainbow colors. Oh, Chelsea. Chelsea. So pretty. And this one's perfect for Alex. Minecrafty. Ooh, thank you. Like your nice shades. Well, everything. if you stare at it, it's like an obstacle illusion, especially if you're looking through a camera. <laughs> Oh, no, don't. You're making me dizzy. <laughs> <laughs> so thank you so much, Julia. That's awesome. Yeah, thank you. It's... <laughs> oh, <my God. laughs> he, like, straight up barked at me. <laughs> it's time for the question of the day. Today's question comes from Am So Fly for Life, and the question is, would you rather talk like Yoda or breathe like Darth Vader? Well, first of all, it'd be pretty annoying all day to go. <laughs> <laughs> now I'm picturing that. Just hear her off in another room and go. <laughs> so okay. I just think it would be kind of cool to talk like Yoda. <laughs> kind of voice. Now, if you breathe like Darth, can you still talk like Darth? If you breathe like Darth, can you? I don't know. Do you it still says, get to talk? This it says, would you rather talk like Yoda or breathe like Darth <laughs> Vader? Talk like Yoda. Mm, yes. <laughs> oh my god. That'd be cool. It'd be kind of hard to understand him though because he kind of talks in riddles, sort of, but I think that'd be cool. I'm going to go with breathe like Darth <laughs> Vader. And the reason why is because like I can't stand it when people like don't talk proper English, yeah. <laughs> even so, even though I may not speak proper English all the time myself, I couldn't stand like, oh, that would just, oh, you guys would drive me crazy because I wouldn't be able to stand to talk like that. Yeah, you're breathing <gasps> all the time would not be annoying because that's all you would do. Like there would be no sentences then, nothing, no words. It just. <sighs> Creepy, just lying there in bed, hearing her in the other room going. <laughs> she does that anyways. She snores. I do not. You lie. <laughs> You're the one who snores. Oh, yeah, you, you are. You snore like a pig. Oh, I do. I'll totally admit that. I'm a snore. I don't snore. The only time I do snore is when I'm sick, like if I have a stuffed up nose or whatever. I don't snore. You liar. You lies. It's not true. <laughs> 
Okay, I'm sticking with Darth because I just couldn't stand to not talk proper English all the time. So we want to know from you guys, would you rather talk like Yoda or breathe like Darth Vader? Leave it in the comments below. What? Imagine we're us doing a video and you sitting right there. You know what? We should totally do it for a day. You guys You're talk like Yoda. Like Darth oh, Vader no. all day. You guys talk like Yoda all day and I'll breathe like Darth Vader for a day. No. That would just be too hard. <laughs> <laughs> That's too much work. No, it's too much work. <laughs> <laughs> that was good. <laughs>